The governor wasted no time getting to what many say is the biggest issue facing New Mexico, a budget in the red. She kicked off this year's legislative session with a plan to balance that budget without raising taxes. We've done this all in the face of extraordinary challenges. The largest structural deficit in state history, a federal government shutdown, federal budget cuts and sequestration that hit New Mexico harder than any other state. Money problems, the focus of Governor Susana Martinez's State of the State address, specifically balancing a budget as New Mexico's biggest industry continues to crumble. And now we face the steepest drop in oil and gas prices ever. The governor's answer to what she calls a crisis in New Mexico. We must continue diversifying our economy and restraining the size of government. Governor Martinez's budget proposal focuses on cutting costs and avoiding raising taxes. We fall on hard times. Government should not expect a taxpayer-funded bailout. Hand in hand with fixing the state's economic woes. Making government more efficient isn't just about cutting. It's making it more accountable. Martinez calls for greater transparency across state government. And legislators should disclose their clients. New Mexicans deserve to know if elected officials are making decisions on behalf of voters or on behalf of undisclosed clients. The governor says she's hopeful. Democrats and Republicans, let's make New Mexicans proud. As the 2017 legislative session officially begins. God bless you and God bless you. Now, the governor said in her address that graduation rates in New Mexico are getting better. In fact, they're the best they've ever been in the state. She doesn't want budget cuts to affect schools within the state. Reporting live here at the Roundhouse in Santa Fe, David Carl, KOAT Action 7 News.